historic artwork from the 1920s that once decorated a room in a Long Island mansion, but was later lost, has now been recreated. And as Miranda Laurie reports, designers say it's all about bringing the outside inside. One of the most attractive outdoor scenes at the Lobster Bay is now indoors. Mrs. Coe's bedroom at Cohaw Mansion was recently restored and features newly recreated landscape murals that fill every inch of the bedroom's wall and ceiling. The original artwork, which was on canvas, was removed and later destroyed by fire. And according to park officials, it cost nearly $100,000 to bring this room back to its original glory. Visitors seem to be pleased with the results. It's a great place for, you know, reflection. I like the quiet, and it's a great escape from suburbia. People need to come out here and see it, and I think it, everyone would enjoy coming out here. It took Broadway scenic artist Polly Wood Holland a full 100 days to recreate these beautiful murals, and she actually only had these two photographs from 1921 to work with. This employee is impressed by the results. I mean, it's just unbelievable standing in here and being able to see uh, the original mural painted back on the walls. Next up for the 65-room mansion is the June reopening of the estate's Italian Gardens. That event will mark the end of what the Planting Fields Foundation calls its biggest preservation project to date. In Oyster Bay, Smiranda Lari, LI News Tonight.